Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier. So today in my this particular video, I am going to discuss how we can send data from a particular S3 bucket to another S3 bucket. That is copying data from one S3 bucket to another S3 bucket. Okay. Uh, so here I have created demo show and destination folder. Both are in same region. Now I will be showing you the lambda code each time when one particular file suppose will be uploaded in this particular demo show uh, bucket that will be copied to destination folder also. Okay, right. So here I will be writing lambda and I will be opening in a new tab and here so create function. And here what is the code uh, programming language I am going to use that is Python 3.8 okay transfer data like this I am giving the name keeping all other properties as it is okay create a new role with basic lambda permission basic lambda permission like cloud watch uh, data logs information etc okay so create function I am keeping all other settings as it is and here our function will be created it might take some time depending on the internet speed okay so let's wait for that and here successfully function is created now we need to trigger each this particular lambda function whatever we are going to write each time whenever new file or uh, new data will appear in the uh, this particular demo show s3 bucket okay so we'll be going to add trigger and from here I am going to choose this S3. The bucket that is originally where data will appear is demo. So I am choosing all object create event. Okay, that is objects will come that time triggering should be happening. So I am keeping this one only. Prefix and suffix I am not explicitly adding. And you have to check this. Okay, this is compulsory and add this. Right. So here now if i go to code and function overview if i check c s3 bucket here one trigger is connected to our this transfer data lambda function now here we need to write our lambda function i'll be going to lambda function dot pi here i'll be deleting this complete one and here i have already written the code which i'll be taking okay right so import boto3 okay obviously which is required i hope you can understand right then def lambda handler event okay which will be containing uh, the event due to which this particular function is triggered and the corresponding context okay so first i am taking the file name which is basically uploaded in my s3 bucket okay and the way to take the file name is this one basically if you just print the event you can easily understand that like key value pair it is stored inside records records is one array so i am taking first element okay that is first index element okay then from there s3 key i am accessing and in s3 key there is object another key and another key is key okay then inside that value part whatever present that is actually the file which is uploaded okay then here i need to specify service name is 3 region name us is 2 because i have shown you that i have created bucket in us is 2 aws access key id aws secret access key both thing you can get from where i am okay you have to create i am user okay and you have to give the full s3 access permission okay let me just create for you just to show you one demo so i am user i am clicking opening in a new tab okay perfect and here uh, already two users created i am creating one more user just for demo programming access i want to give not management console access go to permission attach existing policies directly i want to give s3 full permission next tag and here i am i have given amazon s3 full access just create user okay and here i can download this csv file so here it will be containing my uh, aws access key and secret access key you should not show this to someone I'll be deleting this particular uh, role so that if I am showing for this particular video discussion purpose also no problem and here secret access key I'll be taking from here 
परफेक्ट ओके सो ए डब्ल्यू एस एक्सेस की सीक्रेट एक्सेस की टेकन देन एस थ्री बोटो थ्री डॉट रिसोर्स सर्विस नेम रिजियन नेम एक्सेस की सीक्रेट एक्सेस की ऑल दिस आई एम डिफाइनिंग एंड हियर दिस पर्टिकुलर वन इज टू कॉपी द डेटा फ्रॉम एस थ्री बाकेट एंड पुट इन इन अनदर एस थ्री बाकेट ओके सो कॉपी सोर्स व्हाट इज दिस सोर्स सोर्स इज बेसिकली बाकेट वन इज डेमो शो ओके व्हाई डेमो शो बिकॉज आई हैव टोल्ड यू इन डेमो शो आई विल बी अपलोडिंग द फ्रेश डेटा ओके एंड दैट शुड बी कॉपी टू डेस्टिनेशन फोल्डर एज सुन एज न्यू डेटा विल अपियर इन द डेमो शो ओके सो सोर्स इज दिस वन बाकेट नेम आई एम स्पेसिफाइंग हियर हियर व्हाट एवर इज योर बाकेट नेम दैट यू नीड टू स्पेसिफाई एंड की इज द फाइल नेम दैट इज व्हाट एवर वी आर गेटिंग हियर ड्यू टू व्हिच द ट्रिगरिंग इज हैपनिंग ओके देन एस थ्री डॉट मेटा डॉट क्लाइंट डॉट कॉपी दिस कॉपी कमेंट विल कॉपी दिस पर्टिकुलर कॉपी सोर्स फ्रॉम हियर Uh, this particular one you have to mention what is the destination bucket name like here uh, for my case this is destination folder that's what is defining and then here file name this one is in this parameter is indicating in destination folder what should be the name of the file so i want to keep source and destination file same name okay that is whatever file will come in demo show the same name should uh, the copy should be press coming in the destination folder okay so before going ahead let me show you see this is completely empty and here my destination folder is completely empty see i am refreshing then also it is empty perfect now what i'll be doing i'll be deploying my uh, this aws function and this is deployed perfect now what i'll be doing i'll be going to console is 3 and here i'll be clicking on upload and here i'll be adding files suppose this c to sub file i am uploading which is one csv file okay right and here i am clicking on upload okay see this is i am uploading in demo show okay see it is successfully uploaded now let me show you that i am going to s3 demo show see it is present now it's time to check whether it is copied in destination folder or not see here destination folder is present see it is coming perfectly happening okay i am uploading one more file upload add files it is virginica maybe okay and here clicking on upload see it is uploaded now i can go to s3 and this is under demo show obviously this two will be present but if i go to destination folder see here it is virginica also coming so using this piece of code you can uh, basically uh, copy data from one s3 bucket to other and simultaneously we have seen how we can trigger one particular lambda function based on new data coming in s3 one particular bucket okay so i hope you have understood this this is all for my this video code will be posted in the description box or in the comment section if you find this video helpful then please like share and comment subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed till now and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of my latest videos thank you